The 2020 Carlsbad Mayor's Energy Summit has had to switch things up this year, and like many events during this time, has gone virtual. And Carlsbad is at the epicenter of so much that is happening in the ener energy industry, and there's so much that will be happening. And that's why we felt like it was extremely important that we put together a very informative event, despite everything else. The Energy Summit featured multiple speakers, award presentations, and brought together members of the community and energy industry to learn and discuss important issues. You know, in previous years, there's a thousand plus people um, at the uh, event center. And this is kind of different, you know, just because of COVID, but it's no less effective because now it's going to be up on the web. People can watch it at their leisure. And, you know, the speakers that the mayor brings in are always top notch. I, I still learn something every time I'm a part of this um, as a uh, participant and recipient of a lot of the knowledge and wisdom that many of the speakers have. I think it's a forum where not only our community, but industry has become accustomed to getting together and sharing information and talking about what's going on with industry and how does it affect the community in Eddy County and the city of Carlsbad. Initially, the committee had a, a plan because it, I think it was the 10th anniversary and so they had some big things planned, but when we couldn't bring everybody together, we kind of had to tone it down a little bit, and, but still let people know that it's important to, the, to our community. The summit also benefits those involved within the industry in different ways. You can't beat in person with developing relationships and learning from these people. So that's the best thing the summit does for me. For us, it's a great opportunity to get the message out about transportation and infrastructure funding. Um, shortfalls that we have, we always never have enough money to be able to invest the way we would like in the 11 counties we serve here in southeastern New Mexico. So it's an opportunity to raise awareness and build partnerships. If we partner together, we can, we can combine the resources and talents that we have, and the outcome will be better than if we tried it individually. For News 3 New Mexico, I'm Landry Senna.